going on everybody? Aaron here today for Gunpla Hangar. We're doing something awesome. We are doing the Oh, got it upside down. The RX-79G Gundam Ground Type. Now this is from one of my favorite series of all time. Now Gundam Wing is my absolute favorite of the Gundam series. But this comes from Gundam 8th MS Team. Mobile Suit Gundam 8th MS Team. And 8th MS Team had one of the shortest but one of the best stories in my opinion for a Universal Century uh, series. It focused on Gundam pilots who really we don't hear a lot about, like a, a team of Gundam pilots, because everybody always thinks there's just one Gundam in each series. But these were just like mass-produced gun, not mass-produced, but like quickly produced Gundam series Gundams that were made for ground combat only. So it was really cool to get to see these in action on a 8th MS team. I, I really love the story. I forget most of the story's characters, but I really did like this, the story. It really focused a lot on, like, you know, knowing that your enemy is also like you, but at the same time, you know, it was, it was a really good series. So, anyway, let's get this out of the box and let's see what we got. Okay, so here we have the box, and I'm opening it up right away, and, wow, there are a lot of stickers in here to choose from. Um... Some of these I have never, so I see a set of stickers in there, maybe war slides and else. This is going to be a big kit. I didn't think this was that big, but this is a, I mean it's a 1144, but it's a really more detailed kit. This is like a newer HG kit from the, uh, I mean it's your typical Gundam kit, but it's got a whole lot of runners in it. Uh, this is really nice. And the, de the details look like you can decal it with whatever number you want, so I know which number I'm going for. Uh, so let's go ahead and get started, because I'm really interested. Uh, the tools you will need are, as always, a pair of nippers, a pair of tweezers. I usually like the bent nose tweezers, because they tend to hold on a little bit better, and they give me a better angle. You may need an X-Acto knife, you may need, and you know, for detail stuff, you may need some uh, nail polish. I really don't feel like I'm going to need that with this kit. This feels like it's a newer kit. So, I'm going to go ahead and get the runners out and then we'll get started.
right guys, so I'm back, and this took me like three hours to put together, or maybe like, yeah, about three hours to put together, but here is the final kit. I customized it a little bit with some of the decals, you really can't see because my camera's not trying to focus, but it gives you a few number decals, and my camera's not going to focus on it for some odd reason, I'm trying to get it to, and it doesn't do it. But it's it's not a bad kit altogether. Uh, typical of your almost it's almost like a real grade because I actually had to build the inner workings for most of it, which was really difficult. And as far as it goes, weapons wise, it comes with a few weapons. Like here's a blaster you can put in the hand. Two beam sabers. And the cool thing about the beam sabers is you can actually put the handles in the uh, legs themselves. This bad boy right here, which I was really impressed with. the uh, I remember seeing the sniper rifle here. And uh, another submachine gun, and it came with a hand for the submachine gun. All together, like I said, about a three hour, four hour build, uh, depending on your detailing. And it's really a nice kit. And I like the fact that it comes with the backpack, so I can open this up. Oh, that's, that's, yeah, some of the parts weren't really strong there, but open it up and put that that uh, Gatling gun or that sniper rifle in there for later so anyway that's it for today's build thank y'all so much for watching make sure you like comment subscribe y'all can check me out on Facebook Twitter and Instagram leave a comment below let me know what you thought of today's build or what you like to see me build next click on that bell icon because that's gonna keep you up to date with what we're doing when we're doing it and all that jazz anyway guys uh, also check out our merch shop where you can buy some awesome clothes for uh, clothes masks mugs whatever you want we've got it with all of our merch stuff so definitely go check it out links for all of that's in the description below anyway thank you all so much for watching and we'll see you in the next video